know Jared? He's taking jiu-jitsu classes now. No way. With that kind of power comes serious responsibility. I know, right? For serious. Yeah, ready. Go. Welcome to Amsterdam. Oh, the dam! Where you've got it all. Streets, buildings, people, now trees, marijuana, so and hookers. Hard. It's got everything. Since the dawn of time, the travel show formula has remained unchanged. Until now. Amsterdam. So we've been. So in we've been. <laughs> so we've been in Amsterdam. So we've been in Amsterdam. So we've been. In, so we've been in Amsterdam. So Sorry, I, yeah, yeah, I gotta be happy. Yeah. You keep it. So we've been in. All right, I'm happy too. Yeah, no, okay. I know, but I gotta be happy okay. as well. Okay, ready? Go right. officially now. Right. Ready? Go. So we've been in Amsterdam for about 20 minutes when we realized a pretty serious fun fact. Fun fact alarm activated. There are more bicycles in Amsterdam than there are people. Sweet. Let's go socialize. Yeah. What should one do to enjoy the sights and the city? Shopping. What, uh, what can we compare things to? It's better than New York. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa. How about the wine? Better than Italy? Yes. Yes. Yeah? <laughs> the world. Do a lot of tourists come here for that purpose? Or do they come um, mostly for the marijuana sightseeing. and the weird vibe yes, and, you yes. know, the canals yeah. and everything? Yeah. yeah. Well, we live here, so we used to, uh, you know, sometimes have a joint or... Uh, <laughs> so <casual. laughs> yeah. For us, it's normal. A couple so. joints, buy some yeah. Louis Vuitton handbags, yeah. call it a day. Uh, no, 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 not Louis Vuitton. No. All right. <laughs> you can walk free around here and no one looks at you because you look in a different way or... Yeah, it's so cool. All right, well, that's great for him. <laughs> <laughs> but a bum bum all right, so you look yeah, normal. That's not funny. Else yeah, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> Who do we even want to pay to watch people dress up as death and like wave around with these sticks? That's kind of weird. Like you dress up as a gorilla and they just stand there with like a money bucket. Like I know. Why aren't people? Why aren't people more impressed? Yeah, no. And, and you know pay, I mean? yeah, give me. Look, look at my incredible yeah, skill of being now. able to put on a monkey suit. Like they suck. Well, that's a bit. That's a bit much. Seven fifty euros, kind of expensive for a waffle. Though. No, you're fab. You ride high. Mm. Yeah, you feeling my flow? Yeah. 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 Am yeah. I on your wavelength? Yeah. yeah. Are we on the yes. same wavelength? Yeah. Yes. Uh -huh. Are we tuned on the same radio frequency? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Pound me for it. I left where I posted. Still remember my first line of where I wrote it. Remember my first line of where I smoked it. First grade when pen and paper collided. United ever since, and you can't divide us. By a standard issue series of events that happened to have happened on the Metro Rail Transit system, we are now officially in a park! But there just happens to be a whole bunch of sun, whole bunch of trees, whole bunch of grass, whole bunch of greatness, whole bunch of barbecue, and a whole bunch of hot, hot chicks. Anywhere I'll go, I'll take you along with me. Paper. <laughs> Dear God, your hair is so sexy. <laughs> Please, relax, don't do it. Let your body get to it, all right? So tell me, yeah, but, yeah. people in Amsterdam sexy, not sexy? Yeah, sexy. Really? Yeah, really. This is why things are making sense, you see, in this place, you know what I'm saying? And this is just like, you know what I mean? I thought that was a great interview. You know the Secret Service that guards the president? Yeah. Why are they called the Secret Service, is my question. What is so secret about them? We know they're there, we know they exist. Why aren't they just called the service? Guys, uh, let's do this. All right. Amsterdam is home of many things, such as Purple Haze, Kush, White Widow, AK-47, Green Crack, Isolator, Sativa, and what else? The coffee houses, which sell them to you. Can 
anyone walk into a coffee shop in Amsterdam and buy as much as they want and do whatever they want? No, no, you have to be uh, 21 and you can get 5 grams maximum. We have biological weed, hydro and hazes and also the hashies. I think one of the strongest we have. So it smells, it smells a bit like cheese. We got the high weeds, we got low weeds. So the high weeds uh, will, will keep you up. And uh, the stone weeds for people who are more experienced and uh, just like the, the, the feeling of, uh, of the down. But I mean, obviously, I could never smoke this on international TV. I mean, I have six years of higher education. If I did, smoking this on international TV would prevent me from ever being able to get a job with a large multinational corporation where I sat at a desk all day long figuring out the net present value of various assets that are exposed to amortization over time. I mean, that'd be terrible. After some serious bicycling today, I decided to get a tattoo before we hit the clubs. Can't get a drink without throwing down some ink. I think you should get this, for sure. It's a squid, it's big, a lot of arms, super ambidextrous. If you can grab at anything, kind of the king of the sea, although you won't be in the sea, so you're even more of a king. It's true, but I already know what I want to get. It's gonna be big. My so Miami ink right now, just getting some ink, just throwing down some ink, chilling. <laughs> My name is Fab. This one, this is intense. Does it hurt? Uh, come on, don't be a pussy. Yeah, let's do it. Yeah. Uh -huh. You got a dot on your leg. That's your tattoo. Yeah. You told me you were getting something big. Yeah, it's a big idea. This is Earth from outer space. I'm a spaceman in space looking at it. So you're effectively using imagination as a tool against society, like as a weapon, just going, yeah, think just because I'm a private citizen and not a member of you know, some kind of NASA organization that I can't travel into space? Yeah, I can. Watch me. What a massive fuck you to society. Oh my god, what a fuck you know, to that's society. What I'm you about. Oh, what a lib oh, what a liberal. Oh, what a that's why you hang out with me. That is such a massive statement on such a such a massive this is political. This is pretty much a political movement you started. The dot movement. <laughs> <sighs> oh wow. This will show those fat cats in Washington. <laughs> What percentage of these people are tourists? Um, I guess like 30%. 30%? Yes. All right, so it's, we're keeping it a bit real here. And you just hang out, chill, you have a couple drinks? Yeah, have a couple drinks, maybe smoke a weed before you go into a club and just hanging with chicks and have fun, you know? Are you telling me this is all about lounging? You don't break any light sticks here and rage down? Yes, yes. Just rage drink. This is just the chill. <laughs> this is just the place where you go chill. I'm going to Jimmy Woo right now. How do you feel about that as a local? Jimmy Woo. It's a nice place, but it's a little bit too much makeup. So you're saying the women are a bit too attractive? <laughs> I like the too pure stuff, you know, I like natural looks. No, know, God. I, like, I like the raw stuff, I like techno, I like, you know, pure. Wow, I like fake tits and a <laughs> stupid, stupid girl. Well, the landscape party in Amsterdam is going hard, going all out. So basically, when you get here, you about to get fucked up. That's when people ask me where you from. I say Holland. They say where? That's near Germany, right? I say no, Amsterdam. Oh, Amsterdam. Different, different kind of looking women, you know. Good looking, black women, blonde, 
And Joanne, he asked the guy for light, and he just suddenly attacks Joanne without reason. No, no, no. No, 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 the way to get home from downtown? A bicycle. I rented a bicycle. I'm awesome now. It's a official. Sorry, bro. You know this situation right here? It's pretty much like the hills. All we're missing is me going, oh my god. Did you know that Lauren told Brody that Adrena totally cheated on Christian and Spencer found out and like told Heidi and she's so pissed, she's so pissed. Yeah, that would be so stupid. Totally. I met a girl last night, she has a boat. Give her a call. Who is she? Who is she? Shouke. Oh, Shouke. Yeah, Shouke. She's definitely got some boat action. Yeah. Shouke, I think yeah, is, there's an ass. Oh, yeah. Hey, how's it going, Shouke? It's Fab from the club last night. Remember us? Dope. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we're wondering about your boat ride. You gonna pick us up soon? Sweet. Yeah? Yeah. Uh, yeah, give me a call when you get in. From where? From, no. Abort, abort. Uh. Just go <laughs> later. Later. Hang up. Pro probably some of the best answering machine material I've ever heard. All right, one of the chicks with the boat just called Fab back right now and he's nailing the phone call. Okay, nice. But uh, I think I didn't tell you I had a boat. Uh, you I don't have one. You don't have a boat. No, did I tell you that? So you're just lying? No, I didn't tell you I had a boat, so I don't know. What did you tell me then? I don't know. Oh, I don't know either. Does she maybe have a goat and you misheard? Do you have a goat? We did not have the time to wait for chicks with boats to call us back and get their boats on the water. You know what I mean? We don't have time for that. Nuh-uh. So we got an ice cream boat. <laughs> Vacation schedule. Uh, 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 There's no way you need a boat with a pop of chicks and a whole bunch of drinks. You know what I mean? Give me an ice cream boat any day and I'm in the zone. You pull a lot of chicks driving around the ice cream boat? Yeah? Yeah. Yeah. A lot of chicks. A lot of chicks. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Behind us is the famous wax museum at Madame Toussaint. One of many famous museums in Amsterdam. But outside, the sun is shining and people are beautiful. So we'd rather be here. So in the words of the famous Mr. Miyagi, Wexon, Wexo. You actually, you actually sound mentally impaired. Wexon, Wexo. Wexon. I'm hearing. Wexon. So, in the words of the famous Mr. Miyagi, Wexon, Wexo. <laughs> Tons of Party C4 is packed up all around, ready to detonate right now. 
many festivals in the summer. You guys get excited about the festival? Yes, yes. Best time of your life? Yeah. Are you in the festival spirit? Is that what this is? Well, I think it is. of the world wants to visit Amsterdam. Just why? Not only for smoking weed legal, just drink alcohol and shit, but just the whole spirit, the whole feeling about Amsterdam is just awesome. What's happening, ladies? Oh, do I got... Oh. But what do you like about this place? Yeah, beautiful people. Yeah, beautiful people. Yeah, yeah, yeah you're very nice too. And I've seen a lot of tall women. Yeah. You're not that tall, but... I'm tall. You think you're tall? Yeah, a little. You're my yeah. size. You want to be like this. Yeah, no. Yeah, you want to be smaller? Yeah. <laughs> you can't reach like up to the cookie pie. jars. <laughs> yeah, but you're pretty cute. No, I'm not. <laughs> yes, you are. Oh, oh yeah, I speak Dutch. You speak Dutch? Yeah. Ah. Such a liberal country. But what does unity do? Talk me through. Um, we take, um, we do drug education for all the people on the party, and um, we um, we make sure people take respons re responsibility about what they take and what they do, and make sure they know what drugs they take. In Amsterdam, there is a testing station every Thursday night. You can uh, bring your drugs in, and um, they can, uh, for a small. Uh, amount of money they can test your pill and the next week you can see how many uh, what the drug was and how many milligrams there was in the drug so is that ecstasy cocaine heroin whatever that's ecstasy lsd cocaine ketamine ghb basically everything <laughs> It's a new kind of way of partying. Yeah. No, oh. no, it's it's really it's really simple actually. Yeah. <laughs> what is that? What oh. is that? What is that? Whoa! Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's a whole new way of partying. It's just that simple. A whole when, new when, way of partying. When, when, and, what and it's insane. Do you understand what that means? You're breaking boundaries. You're shoving down what, everything. What is this? You're it's kicking kind of doors carnage. here. No, 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 wait, 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 wait. If you never thought about it, that's enough. Deep. This is really deep. It's one of the oldest professions in the world. Prostitution. And in Amsterdam, it's legal, controlled, and taxed. Now given, it's not very popular to be filming on these streets, so we're gonna have to go undercover, pretty super Call of Duty style. Yeah, stealth mode activated. Welcome to the Red Light District. Or do I have to do both? We suck at the same time, and you can both of us. You suck at the same time? What, what can we do? I don't know. What do you like? I like it, like little kinky stuff. So if you're into this, get into this. Because you didn't come for the gangbang, you certainly came for the sights and sounds, alright? Because that was fun, alright? I saw some things. I did something. <laughs> I did some things. <laughs> How come you didn't talk to anyone? See, this is the reason why relationships fail, is because of the talking. That is why you pay prostitutes money, is so they don't talk. So, not to ruin the relationship. It's purely, you know, sexual, like, writhing in the moment. See, these are, you know, see, that's why I did, Okay, you know what, my logic is sound. <laughs> 
Now it's a well-known fact that MacGyver can take two paper clips, one rubber band, and make a space satellite. But now it's a self-evident fact that Amsterdam can take good vibes, joy, great people, and an awesome atmosphere to make the best time of your life. So who are you? MacGyver? Or some dude sitting alone on the couch with no ticket to Amsterdam? Whoa, 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 whoa! Ultimatum launched! Say like, hey, how was your trip to Berlin? But I would, I would be more like, hey, Berlin, how was your trip inside me? You know what I mean?